The word for the day is accountability. I know that's been a word for the day before, but it's it's an important enough word that we'll repeat it. Um, and I'm going to have a post up on the uh, blog in a little while. Um, and, and what it is is there's a particular member of the legislature who is a Democrat who... Um, in a pretty notable way betrayed a a significant constituency of the Democratic base. Um, And I'm gonna make sure to call call him out on that. And I think it's important (coughs) that we make sure that the, the, the legislators that we elect who are Democrats act like it. I know that's not always possible, and I know there, there are people who are in districts or whatever, um, but there's a, a, a very strong misguided belief by many Democrats that the way that you get into office and stay into office is be middle of the road and appeal to effectively n- nobody, um, but it doesn't make sense and it's not the reality of the situation. Barring a wave type election like you saw in 2010 (coughs) the way you get into office and stay into office is by clearly connecting with the voters letting them know what your values are um, expressing it in a way that people can understand it and then backing it up by supporting the people that you share those values with supporting the organizations that are related to those values and supporting legislation that is consistent with those values. The more you do that, the more people on your side are excited by your candidacy, the more they volunteer, the more they give money, um, the more they they show up to vote, and the more they share their conviction with fellow voters. And unless you have just a huge amount of money to blanket a state or district with, you need help from supporters and Democrats and union members and teachers and um, women and minority groups in the LGBT community and Hispanics. You need help from these groups talking to other people in these groups, getting them to support you. And the only way you do that is by supporting these groups, standing up for them when push comes to shove and when the other side attacks these groups, you attack back. Um, And we need to make sure that we hold people accountable for doing that.